Certainly wasn't anything I did. Because <laughs> I don't do anything. I just show up. Now it is. I don't know why that stops. Oh, 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 Mother of. Is that better? Yeah. Is it starting to aesthetic? Yeah, just no audio. We were so tired of the audio issues that we decided to go full silence. Nobody knows how we started the show. Nobody, Nobody knows. knows. So this is what happens. This is what's so annoying and why it always happens. And now I understand all TV production and why they don't they take so long to change. Because all I did was fucking update Windows. And then it decided, oh, you, you know that thing you were connecting to for the past, like, 14 episodes? Uh, it's different now. So, <laughs> yeah. They're really into the game right now. Just everyone shut up. Yeah, no speaking. Everyone shut up. It works now. It's so annoying. Lol, lol, lol. Lol. Oh, you gotta be careful. Oh, they all. I gotcha. I got it. I know how it works. Like, what a goofy thing to put in your citadel. Yeah. Like, like you know what? Let's make puzzle. all the. Let's just do dangerous bridges. And then when you step on a color, it, it, go, it goes down. Okay. The I reply don't what your first was. was. We will probably play them after we finish Jack and Daxter. Yeah, they won't play Jack and Boxster. That and was the joke Jack I made. And Boxster. I said Jack and Boxster. And then I said, I have the new Jackbox. And we went back and forth on what's the new one. And I said eight. And, 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 and I yeah. do have eight, but. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I, I made it. Yeah, almost, yeah, it was good. Um, you know, you can you can jump, jump, and do the helicopter thing. To I have a nine, or they have a nine now, but I don't have nine. I could do the helicopter. How do I do it? Jump, jump, and then circle. Not that. Yeah, that. that's it. Well, you missed them all, so we gotta. They're sure. better the second time, anyway. Especially when you've been forced to explain them. You're oh, just like, I don't even want platforms. <laughs> Yeah, they are up to Jackbox 9. I hope it's like Quiplash 4. <laughs> it's the same Quiplash, but it's 4. 
For who? It's the four plash. For who? For Sooth? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, what do we want to talk about this week? Let's talk uh, about. Let's ride that red wave. Let's, yeah, I was going to say, let's talk about the midterms. Let's talk about oh that God. red wave. Let's talk about that diminishing red wave. First, <laughs> I hit circle by accident. First of all, I, I don't remember any, hearing anyone talk about a red wave. Um, oh, I did. I Well, but I don't watch anything but Twitter, so. It was on Twitter. I'm sure it was. <laughs> um, you know, I, I, I don't I don't pay too close attention. That's all to say, Mr. Man, that there absolutely was a ton of chatter and articles and editorials and all the shit written about how there was going to be this red wave. And all the polls towards the end yeah. were like, it's going to be this huge thing. No. This is the right way still? Oh, yeah, yeah, you're good. I was just saying, like, no. No, I was just making sure. It's just, it's bullshit. Like, the only reason... Republicans are, are still even in power where they are. It's because of unfair, like, district mapping. Like, the majority of people do not want those policies. It's just the districts are drawn a certain way. Yeah, it, so that that's what <coughs> that's what happened this so this past cycle. One Lionel, I will kill you. Uh, I mean, Red 13. Whoever Lionel is, I don't know. But he better watch his ass. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, you messed up. Oh, they uh, gave you some eco there. That's nice. I'm, I'm trying to explain while whilst doing this. So, redistricting happened <clears throat> in 2020 based on the census. And the freaking botched-ass census. Yes. Which was done on purpose. Yes. <clears throat> so, oh! that was done at state levels. Oh. So whoever controlled the state houses and senates and stuff controlled redistricting for the different states. Um, there was a couple states that had, like, independent uh, commissions, but a majority of them were all, like, the majority of state houses are and were Republican held. Um, oh! oh, fuck. Terrifying. And uh, so what happened was most people feared for the worst, like that these gerrymanders were going to be huge, huge, huge. What ended up happening, there was GOP gerrymanders. The ones that existed were already so fucking bad that it was, like, hard to do worse. Yep. But what ended up happening is most of the redistricting was just to keep safe seats safe. They didn't really do much to screw with the map. That's not to say they didn't do anything. Yeah. They just didn't do much. Um, well, what I... What I when I said that, I didn't mean the read. Just I just meant in general. Yeah, I was just trying to give like a yeah. history. Yeah, it wasn't a, a direct response to what you said. But nobody pulled like Gen Z voters. Right. And what ended up happening really was um, uh, Roe v. Wade got overturned. And um, yeah. I don't know if you know this. It's Ro uh, Roe v. Wade's a pretty popular piece of of, uh, of law. Yeah, a lot of people didn't like that. So wait, go back behind you a little bit. <clears throat> Get that stuff. Oh, yeah. So to that, so to speak, like the the maps were were still extremely a, an extreme Republican advantage, um, which they will continue to be. It's just how it is. Now, what ended up happening for results wise for the midterm? One, it's not fully over. They're still counting votes. We still yeah. don't know who controls the House and the Senate. <clears throat> Most likely, what the outcome is going to be is the Republicans are going to control the House by a few yep, seats. Yeah, it's going to be a mixed bag. And what's probably going to happen is the Democrats will probably control the Senate still with a with a slim margin. Probably. Yeah. Uh, that again, we'll still counting see. stuff, and there's a runoff in Georgia next month between Herschel Walker and uh, Robbie. God, Obama. like, why are people still voting for Herschel Walker? I know. It's insane. So, <clears throat> um, given that, everyone, including myself, I was kind of, like, pessimistic on it, uh, just because... Historic well, midterms it usually historically for the party in power, they usually get punished in the midterms. Yep, um, that's how it's happened for like ever. Didn't really happen that much this time, um, which to me is it, fuck. I, I I can't. It's always that same one. Uh, so slim margin, it would be the same number mostly. Most likely, it'll be fifty or fifty-one. Um, so you still have the same exact politics in play there. Um, unfortunately. Uh, but what it was, like I said, 
you have to look at it in context because what was probably going to happen uh, from all accounts was they were going to lose both houses. Like at the beginning of the cycle, uh, like a couple, like a year and a half ago, everyone thought like, it's because it's going to be a blowout. Republicans are going to get 50 seats in the House. They're going to blow out the Senate um, because the <laughs> just maps blow the Senate's back yeah. out. <laughs> yes, exactly. Uh, just not, <clears throat> just not it. And um, so yeah, that di- that didn't happen at all, which is good in my opinion. Again, I am not like some huge Dem booster by default um, of the two parties. I if I have to vote for one, I have to vote for that. But the Democrats piss me off so fucking much all the time. Uh, oh, man. Didn't think I was going to hit that. Um, it's so hard to talk and do this. Oh, yeah. And uh, that's, all to, that's all to say. That's, that's very all to say. Um, surprising outcomes for the midterms. Yeah. Um, in, in a good way. Yeah, smash that. Did it. Dope. Uh, I think the big thing about the Senate, which has been good, and I think I said it about a week ago. I don't know this man. I don't know this man. That's the blue eco man. <laughs> Is the, the Dems having the uh, Senate allows them to put judges on the court which matter for that matters so much so much and they've been doing it a good they've been doing a good job of it and so if they continue to keep the senate they can keep that's the problem judges with really good the democratic party is that they don't play the long game like they don't they don't play smart no they they, fuck this no they don't i think what's (coughs) you know changing and it's at a glacial fucking pace um is why wasn't, <laughs> Why wasn't that turning? Why wasn't that turning? Why wasn't that turning? Is there's a lot of young, like uh, people who are now involved in uh, like activist spaces that were, have been working for now multiple cycles. Yeah. Uh, including myself and a lot of other people, and so those those long term strategies that the party has not had for ever. And again, most of these people, including myself, aren't doing it because they, they feel some sense of loyalty to the party they're doing it because they need some mechanism for like a mass movement because somebody's gonna have to vote and it just so happens one of those parties is insane and the other is bad yeah so you just you use what you got um so yeah, the long, the long-winded. That's a very long-winded explanation to say that the mid- fuck this. <laughs> do you do you want me to do it? Uh, for you like talk? five minutes, like five minutes, and then I'll I'll just <laughs> finish up my thoughts here. That's what you said. <laughs> that's what you said last. I, last I know, week. but like I mean it. I uh, mean just it. like five minutes. Um. Uh. Yeah. So midterms was pretty good. Uh. There's still things being decided. Um. You can check stuff. Overall. Uh, turnout was not as good as it was in 2018, but it was still really high. Yeah. The big surprise was Gen Z showed up. Yep. Um, they voted because of primarily climate change and uh, abortion access. Uh, those are the two. Imagine like caring about your future. Uh, exactly. Exactly. Um, they showed uh, vote breakdowns for the different age groups, uh, including us, the uh, the millennials. Millennials. Wow. Very, very slim. Uh, it's like a plus four for Democrats. That's pitiful. That is really bad. That fucking millennials. Sucks. Um, we can do better. Gen Z was like plus fifty four. Yep. And then uh, every age group above us, like boomers and the silent, was all like R plus whatever. Sixty five and older was like R plus seventeen or something crazy. Uh, all that means is like uh, they voted for Republicans seventeen percent more than Democrats. Um, locally, that's what I want to talk about locally. So what I've been working on for the past year plus in campaigns is uh, we work to get some people elected, and they all all the people we supported, all of them, um, won their races. Uh, we knocked on cool. forty thousand doors. We ca- made three thousand calls, and they all won, which is just so gratifying to see people you've worked with in the past um, get their seats. Oh, that Hakama dude is insane. Yep. He's not, like a 
Not um, like happy. A crazy anti CRT, but there was three of those candidates. Yeah, only one. Only him got through, even though he's probably the worst one. And one member of a. That this this really went. One member isn't gonna. I mean, it's gonna, it's a problem, but it's not like. Like I said, he's probably the worst one. Yeah. Um, unfortunate for me, I I couldn't vote for any of them. They didn't. They were not. Same. Yeah, they're not part of uh, what I could vote for. So, uh, that sucks. And I hope that he's so alienated that he gets nothing fucking done. Yep. And then he loses next cycle. Because he's, like, insane. So, the takeaway for me is... He graduated from high school in 1959, also. Fuck. Um, our strategy is working with talking to people in the community and building this. Like, it, it, we have a pr two, two election cycles proven of people getting elected that we support. Um, I hope... Everybody listening to the stream gets involved with me. I will. I swear, it's great. It makes you feel good, and uh, it, it, it helps the, the community to like let people who like give a fucking shit. Um, not only that, but uh, we the, in the state. The state pretty bad. Pretty bad overall. Um, <coughs> the the Democratic Party in the Indiana State House at the or the state party is. Horrendous, worse than bad. Just really, really awful. They are useless. They don't do anything. They've lost cycle after cycle, and they're refusing. They're very intransigent. Um, however, the people that we were worked with that are also working in other parts of the state, because we all kind of like had our, our regions, um, flipped a seat. So again, when we show up, it works. Mm -hmm. Uh, I think that's all I have for my midterm wrap up. Um, was pleasantly surprised given everything that's happened. Uh, not bad. <clears throat> On to more fun news. Uh, not fun, actually. Kind of not fun at all. But it's just amazing to watch. Twitter is dying. <laughs> I know. Thank you. That's midterm wrap up. Uh, I hope I, if you have any questions, I can try to answer them. I I know this so too too much, unfortunately. Uh, no, I went too early. Yeah, Twitter is dying in real time. I've never seen somebody blow through forty-four billion dollars at such a pace. Um, maybe he'll die. Maybe it'll he'll die too. Elon Musk, so world record speed run, forty-four billion dollars in the trash. <laughs> Twitter speed run. Yep, uh, any percent. He. I, I genuinely like that the bird the bird app. It's yeah, it's fun. Uh, can you tell me why it's dying? Yes. So what's happening is um, I don't know where you came into it, but <coughs> Elon Musk bought Twitter for forty four billion dollars uh. about two weeks ago, literally two weeks. Um, he it's mostly fine. It's a leveraged buyout, so all of the financing is done through debt. Um, he doesn't actually he didn't have forty four billion dollars cash on hand. He's not. He's a billionaire, but he's uh, he's not a paper billionaire. He he has it in stocks and stuff, so it's it, it fluctuates. Um, given that he couldn't afford it because Tesla's shares went down, which is the majority of what he had his his billions in, and so he had to get some other folks involved, like the Saudis and banks and all these other like uh, shadowy figures. To, yeah, totally fine. To cough up the money to afford to buy Twitter, um, and so when he did. Uh, he had all these things that he was gonna say. He's like, "Oh, I know how to make money. I'm gonna." He's like a he's like an idiot libertarian, like you are when you're like 13 years old. Uh, like you don't understand how anything mm -hmm. at all works, and you just think that like, oh, if we just if we just do markets, and everyone could just do whatever the fuck they want all the time with no rules beyond just con contracts, then it will be okay. Um, world doesn't work like that, and that's like shown time and time again how how bad that is. Anyway, he's taking that ideology and his bad humor to Twitter. So his big initiative has been, I'm going to allow uh, people to pay eight dollars, and it's only eight dollars because he was originally going to say twenty, and then Stephen King's like, I'm not going to pay that. He's like, How about eight? That's literally how that was figured out. <laughs> to buy a blue check, which a blue check, you couldn't do it, you, you had to be verified. You were like a a good, like like somebody important. It, it was very arbitrary. It wasn't perfect system, but it was like, if you are a journalist or someone, it was like a way to verify that, that like that's you. Uh, it's a real person. It's a real person, that's you, you're important. Um, and so now he's like, oh, you can just buy it. Um, so that rolled out 
today. For eight dollars. For eight dollars. Um, and the other thing was like, if you had a check mark and didn't pay the eight dollars, you were supposed to like remove it. But they have this like two-tiered system. Anyway, in the app, you can't actually tell. So, a bunch of people left the company. Like, ha first off, half the half of them got fired, just arbitrarily. Uh, half of people at Twitter. And then they realized, oh no, we hired like the people who know how to run the site. So they were like trying to hire people back. Like I'm not even kidding how how stupid this motherfucker is. Um, and then a bunch of people like higher ups kept leaving in charge of stuff, and it's been like a slow trickle. Then this thing rolls out today, and like of course it looks like you're verified. So a bunch of people paid eight dollars to buy like parody accounts. So someone. Um, yeah. the, the big one today was someone made uh, uh, one that looked like Lily, like the pharmaceutical company, got the blue check mark, <laughs> had everything, and said, hey, thanks, everybody. Insulin is now free. <laughs> and everyone, like, retweeted it, like, hell yeah. <laughs> and then Lily, the company, had to come out and say, um, uh, no, we're, that's we're not still, us. You still got to pay for the, yeah, the yeah. insulin. Which one makes Lily look bad. And and Twitter is, is it barely, if it makes any money, it barely makes any money. And it it's fully reliant on advertisers. So advertisers started pausing their stuff because Musk is a moron who's volatile, like, like a week ago. And then all of them today were like, oh, fuck no. So like... It is crashing and burning in a big way. Not not just with the advertisers, but like infrastructure, because the people don't work there anymore. Also, like day one, he's like, comedy is now legal on Twitter, and then Kathy Griffin made fun of him, so he banned oh, her. Oh, a bunch of people like impersonated him, <laughs> and well, my mine is like not like not a parody account of. It's like yeah, I changed my name. Where do we go after Tigger? Uh, so. Uh, a lot of people are trying to figure that out. Um, I'm on a couple of potential candidates. Uh, I'm on Mastodon. It's a little, it's not much confusing, but it's a little more confusing to like uh, sign That's up. It's been around for a while, right? It has, and I've had it for a while. Um, a lot of people are going over there. Uh, you can go to Parlor if you want. <laughs> Um, I don't I, know what that is. You, uh, it's like a right wing Twitter club. What's the What's the Donald Trump like, freedom? Truth, truth social. Truth social. Um, I won't be going there either. A couple of uh, like a lot of people are also going to co-host, which is like a, a kind of like a Twitter slash longer post thing. Uh, a lot of people are going back to Tumblr. Um, Tumblr's not. I, I never had one. Um, I know. I know it was uh, Google Plus. A lot of people like Tumblr. It's time for Google Plus again. I've mostly been using Mastodon because it's the closest thing to Twitter. Uh, the difference is, is like it's a federated system, so uh, there's no like central Mastodon. There is people like anybody can set up their own Mastodon instance, yes. like a server, and then you can join it, and then that joins to other like automatically it joins to other um, Mastodon servers. So you don't ha you can see it at like people's uh, they call them toots, <laughs> toots because it's like a. a <laughs> It's like a mastodon. It has a trunk. Um, you can see everybody's there uh, from any server. You don't have to like be on the same server or anything. And if there's like, you know, some some dingus that's like a, a bunch of Nazis that get together and make their own mastodon, like whoever runs your instance can be like, we're blocking that one. So then you won't be able to see it because it's like, okay, if there's like a an explicitly like white nationalist or like racist thing, you can, the, the the admin can just block it. Um, and yeah, I, I think it's pretty good. Um, I'm not totally convinced that Twitter's gonna die completely. Right. Um, it's looking like it's going to, but I think what's gonna happen is, uh, well, you know what? I don't know what the fuck's gonna happen, but what I, I hope happens is it, it kind of tanks so bad and, and falls apart for a while that like somebody picks it up for pennies and tries to revive it. Yeah. And then Elon Musk, as he is currently being like, just shows him to be like a complete fraud, like he is, um, and he loses all his money. That would be my goal. <laughs> Elon Musk eat shit is my official um, endorsement. Why? What are your names? Why a cult? <laughs> you just be friends with us. No cult. <laughs> Um, so that's that's my lowdown on Twitter. It's a mess. Uh, I spend 
a lot. I spent so much of my life on Twitter, so it is. A, it's a little bit sad, and a lot of people were doing a lot of like, uh, like, for Twitter, overly sentimental posts about like how it's failing because they've like build relationships. Most of Twitter is like very, very irony poisoned. And most people are getting like, eh, it, I know I'm on here and I suck, but like I'm gonna miss like talking to people. Yeah, you should be. I, I think you are. I could be friends. I think you are friends. Um. um that. What else you want to know? Oh, uh, I can play again too. I, I just wanted to get the midterm thing out. Oh, you keep going. Okay. This is like, <laughs> I'm reliving my childhood. <laughs> uh, what else is happening? So, who wants to know Matt's medical history? All right, so. <laughs> oh, God, we're still on the air? Uh, uh, I got all of my. Do I want to escape I do not have a job. Oh, my God, me too. Um, I would love that. Uh, I don't think a cult's going to do that, but we all collectively together with solidarity can do it. The heck, where am I supposed to go? Um. Pokemon oh. Scarlet, uh, definitely excited about that. Allergies, so I went to go get tested for allergies because um, I'm still trying to figure out this stupid skin thing. Got my uh, environmental thing. One, 36 needles. 36 actual needles in my arm. Just bleeding. That's how they test it. Just bleeding down my arm. Um, oh, the allergy test? Yeah. yeah. And uh, I'm allergic to every tree, pretty much. He's like, you're just allergic to like trees. <laughs> mold and very allergic to dust mites um and then so he was telling me like okay from this period to this period you're, you're gonna be like this this and then he and i was like so all year and he's like yep all year and i was like okay he's like we can talk about doing a shot and i was like let's do that so um uh, i had my food one today no food allergies let's go no food allergies um so Many needles. I can't. I would love to get a drink with you all tomorrow. I'm out of town tomorrow. I'm, I'm going to Madison for the marathon um, that's this weekend. So um, I will have to get a rain check on that, and I would love to do it another time. Um, they call the allergy shot. They have to like make it specifically for you, and they're like, "We have to make the serum." And I was like, the "Ooh, allergy serum. Good work, boy. what kind of like oh, eye of newt do we have to put into now. the serum?" It is way Ew, too You're allergic to I have new. Oh shit, yeah. We'll open the they had like uh, the, the first thing was like little these yeah, like yeah, little plastic plastic start. pricks they put and in your back, and I was like, oh, it's not too bad. They just kind of like poke your skin the and then put the little thing on there. But then they have to like the needles were like a trays of hypodermic needles. And I was like, oh fuck, okay, let's go. Thank you, thank you for the for the luck. Uh, Pokemon Scarlet Violet, Violet, super stoked about that next week. Um, I have it coming. I hope it comes to... It's go I'm going to come. <laughs> I'm going to come. <laughs> I hope it comes to the house. Uh, b like the day of, because I ordered it online. Yeah, I have um, I have one more set of allergy tests next week. It's like a, a patch that I have to wear for two days. Can't shower during that time. Solid. And then they take it off, and they, it's like chemical building blocks for allergies so that'll be my like last set of allergy stuff i usually go water starter i usually do the water starter i i'm usually uh my first one my favorite one uh squirtle Pip my, piplup piplup's good piplup's cute i uh want to be able to trade stuff because uh, the Red 13 made me a perfect Squirtle, and I want to take that into the new game. That's right. Butters? My very first Pokemon when I bought uh, Pokemon Blue back in, like, whatever, 96. I called my Squirtle Butter. And then it became a Blastoise. <laughs> but I didn't have that game anymore, so the Red 13 caught me a, a perfect statted uh, oh, Squirtle. Nice. Um, and traded it to me for a birthday present. It was really, really nice. Uh... But yeah, Pokemon, I'm super stoked about it. I think it's going to be good. I be, I've done my best to avoid spoilers. I know Red13 put that in the, the Snapchat group today, and I was like, nope. I just closed it. I'm like, uh, I'll wait. <laughs>
Is this the final boss? It sure is. Wow. We actually were true to our word and we're going to finish this game? I tell you, I blasted through that citadel. Oh, no. You don't have to. I didn't I didn't look at it. I, you said spoilers, and then I was like, okay. <laughs> I know. And it's not like Half-Life 2 where we keep thinking it's the final boss. <laughs> Uh, thanks for SC Jane. I am I am doing my absolute best, uh, and it's only costing me a small fortune to do it, unfortunately, or very fortune, it Lee. Ah! I also did eight hours of driving yesterday out of town. Super not tired from that. I don't recommend it. How's everybody else doing? I've been yapping. How's your week been? Anything cool going on? Anything interesting? Maybe not cool, but just interesting going on. Tim, you are also allowed to answer. I'm sorry. What? No, 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 no. no. Just I, I didn't want to be like, ah, uh, yeah, Tim, shut up. I'm just talking to the chat. Yeah, I. It was it was more that I wasn't anticipating it being eight hours because I like it was a bunch of hours and then a bunch of work I had to do during that. That's why I was out of town. Um, I was like helping my family like install a bunch of <laughs> shit and move Just a bunch of stuff. Swan dove, <laughs> swan dove into the thing. I'm sorry, I uh, no, it's fine. wasn't paying attention to anyone. Um, I'm glad you're getting over your uh, cough and sore throat. That has been going a round. There's this, I forget what it's called. There's something that kids are picking up. Does anyone have it? Like, there's a, like, it's not COVID, but it's this cold thing that's going on. Certain, maybe there's an R. I think it's respiratory. R-S-M. Yeah. R-S-V? R-S-V. Yeah. Um, I heard that's just, like, catching, like, wildfire. Eco won't protect you. Into this boss. What what is he trying to do? Like open this eco silo, this dark eco silo. And that's gonna. It has like a enormous supply of it. Ugh. Okay. And then these guys come out, and uh, they're spiky, and I can't touch them. Been around forever. It's in the same family virus as common cold. Okay. So is it a is it a coronavirus? Not no. COVID, but RSV. Oh, I don't know. I don't think so. Because like the common cold is also a. a can be a coronavirus. Ah, oh, that sucks. Have your boys been uh, able to clear it? Any holiday plans? Um, nothing big. Probably just go to my family's for Christmas. Um, I'm taking time off, which I'm super stoked about. Um, it's my one time of the year. I have, let's say this. Since I started working as an adult, I have never taken not Christmas time off. Everything has always been like a four day weekend. Uh, I'm trying to change that, but I'm always excited because it's my two weeks off during the year where I don't have to work all the fucking time. And with the election being over, it's truly like I don't have to like do any work. Um, very, very, very stoked. Oh, uh, gotta go, 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 go. Never seen no, go, no, go, no, go, no, go, no, 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 no. Oh, okay. It's inappropriate. Best ever Thanksgiving. Um, we might come to it. I, I don't. I think I saw a message about it, but I, I didn't read it carefully. Um, I know I'll be here for Thanksgiving, so potentially that's going to work out pretty well. But I've been so I I've been so busy today. I actually had to go into the office today to, to get some files that happened before we got um, some some bad stuff happened at work earlier in the year. So all my old files were on there. He's got a he's got a big big gun there. I'm assuming from that response, uh, Caitlin, that, that you are attending said best holiday Thanksgiving ever. I think that was it. 
Uh, oh no, it's using the different science colors. Yeah, it's white eco. I totally missed the story. What's this mosquito man? I'm sorry, what? I, what's the mosquito man? The That's like a big monster robot thing that those two bad guys woke up like they reactivated it and they're using it to open the silo, but we're stopping them. Gotcha. I love stopping them. Husbros. The Husbros. <laughs> I love Husbros. That house is also, uh, I'm pretty sure, referred to as Ass Club 7. That's, a, that's an old take. Oh, look, you get white eco. That's right. Look at how shiny you are. So shiny. We do. That was it? That was it, yeah. Wow. You didn't even get to use the white eco. I know. That sucks. You should have been able to, like, supersonic him. Yeah. No need. Yo, the victory music. Victory dance. A choreographed victory dance. Like, they planned this out. Oh, he's going underwater. <laughs> Now does Daxter Who get to turn back into a real boy? Yeah, no. <laughs> no. Boys. You do have what it takes to be heroes. But Daxter, now we can't change you back. Don't worry about me, baby. You know what they say. Big things come in small packages. Jack, you I feel like he's talking about his Daxter penis. <laughs> I feel like he's not as upset as he should be. Usually the stream shows how many accounts are tuned in, and without that, it's a little harder to gauge how much space will be in your chat. None of this would have been possible. What? <laughs> Is it not showing how many viewers there are? Is Twitch having some issues? Twitch shoes? Twi Twitch shoes. The dark eco probably destroyed them. Weird. Probably. Probably. Bring them on. We can take them again. Right, Jack? I said, right, Jack? Uh. Uh. Wow. Oh, Where we can't show that on TV. Uh-uh. That's it. Apparently, Caitlin sees the counts. Naughty Dog. Naughty Dog Incorporated. Wait, I did. Uh, so, yes, I did. Uh, they, welcome to the, the chat. Um, I, I gave a whole <laughs> midterm breakdown <laughs> for a while. Oh, yeah. And you just, you just, uh. We just beat the game. Uh, mostly Tim beat the game. I, Both of us together. <laughs> this whole game I've been mostly... Is that, you play for five <laughs> minutes. Play for five minutes and I'll, I'll take it back from you. I kept dying because I was trying to give a, a <laughs> midterm breakdown. <laughs> and I, I didn't want to give it back. <laughs> yeah. Um, Cerny Games. Cerny Games. Cerny, my, uh, 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 Mark Cerny um, is the one who designed the PS4 and Mike the PS5. Gollum. And he's also a game programmer. Mike Gollum. Um, Sorry, I got excited by no, that. No, I Max Casella. That's the voice of Daxter. D. Snyder. D. Snyder. <laughs> That's awesome. How was the show, um, Amaticon? There was a show at uh, Civic tonight uh we're gonna go actually see that same show on sunday nice kevin conroy batman so, himself he the was fisherman. the fisherman wow wow more michael Gollum. they got a lot of names in here oh it was amazing that's good to hear there you go you got something to look nice forward nice to. nice so I would I would see it. I couldn't see it tonight because <coughs> we had this and I just had too much to do today. Out of town this weekend, and then I'm in a show on Thursday, which by the way got changed. I'm actually if you in the show. If you want to come to our show I at LBC on Thursday, That's I right. am in the show. I was originally doing sound. We swapped Freaky Friday style. Now I'm doing the sound. Now he's doing the sound, and I'm gonna be in the show. That's right. Do I know for free? Maybe it's not the same show I'm thinking of. It's um Lucky st or uh something Lucky stiff. stiff? Lucky okay, yeah, I'm gonna see that on yeah, Sunday. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So uh, our friend and also fellow organizer 
hero organizer who did so much for these campaigns is the director, Brian Coker. Connie Booth. That's right. Oh, great. I, I'll be in it. Tim, Tim will be on mic. <laughs> I'll be on mic. I hope that you just take it up and you're like, you know, we've had a lot of fun here today. Yeah. <laughs> just Everybody, <laughs> let's just take a minute. <laughs> just take a minute. Let's have a, a moment let's of silence. break it down. Moment of silence for Martin Fernandez. Uh, Brian's, Brian is so great. If you don't know, I think some people in the chat, Red 13 might know Brian Coker um, because I know Mike knows him. Uh, who might be related to the Red 13. I don't know. I'm just mentioning people out loud. Um, <laughs> it doesn't even matter. Who you, uh, Ian McGinnis. <laughs> Edward yeah. Toomey. Let's give it up for Steven Gonzalez. Oh, yes. Brandon Dubé. Brian Sacco. We got Darren Mayer in the... David Turner. And Ernie Toten. Joel Manzano. We got Kevin Keith and Lenny Gordon. I, it's, <laughs> I don't... I don't want to we say got Syracuse Semathasinato. Oh uh, man, I really wanted to say that right. Caitlin, I don't want to say y'all because it's really it's me. It's listen, y'all. Tim's not doing anything for name dropping. It's all me that I keep oh, yeah. screwing up. It's all you, Demarlo King. I'm I'm kind of focused on the on the game. Kazirai was the guy who was in charge of um, PlayStation, <laughs> then Andrew House and Jack oh, Trent. Nice they were all in charge of Sony. <laughs> I I'm the same way. I, we're, I I told uh, Caitlin Brian this that I don't. It's like my brain doesn't believe that someone is a real person unless I've met them like four or five <laughs> times. So like the first time someone meets me, I'll learn things that you know in the first time. I, I'll just it wipes instantly. I have no recollection. Don't remember names, anything about <laughs> them, like where they're from, what they do. It just it just drips through. I try to I try to make it a point to remember a thing about a person. Like so, if they talk to me, I'll be like, "Oh, like they're into like this type of band, or they're this." Because uh, next time we meet, I want to be like, "Hey, I remember you," and here's like a, a small fact. Too. Yeah, it's it. It's hard. It's too much. My my brain won't do it. Oh my god! Can I, I want to tell this anyway? Because I saw it in. So grown up Malk. Um, today got burned so fucking bad. Oh, he did. Oh my god! It's one of those burns that is like. Kids think it up, and it just cuts to the core of your whole person. Flair Brit here. Um, apparently, uh, this is me retelling it from what I saw in the in the Snapchat group. Um, that he, some some kid goes up to him and he goes, "Sup, forehead." That was it. Woo! Done. <laughs> Woo! Just dropped. Completely dropped. <laughs> People are too too clever by half with some of the insults they try. Just, just do that. Just go for the jugular. Just died. Just died. Just. Devastating. Man, there's a lot of people who worked on this game. You got Leo Connor, Sean Burroughs, James McLaughlin. You told Caitlin Brian? Who told? Me when I was telling that thing about not remembering people. I mean I know specifically I told her that because she always remembers everything about everyone she ever meets. Is that true? Yeah. It is true. I, I'm like way too open about my life on here, so I you probably know some embarrassing stuff. Yeah, you. I don't remember who else was in the room. I think it was probably during lunch, so probably you were there and a couple other coworkers. But oh, I, you also told you also told me. <laughs> I don't make Vera Curry, <laughs> Vera Curry Jane. <laughs> oh wait, ooh, look, 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 look. I'm a minor part, but. Door. It wow. looks like it will only open if we fill all 100 holes with power if we just, cells. Okay. Here we go again. So there's like an extra level that you get to get to? I doubt it. I bet it's probably just a video. Please include for attention. I don't even know what's happening here. Pizzes. I don't know what, what you're left out of. <laughs> she, she doesn't know what, but she has a suspicion that she's being left out of something. It's... Uh, <laughs> this isn't... this. I see Jane said... How do I wake this back? Okay. He's <laughs> filled all 100 holes for dead. Is, is Tyrant Heal here? Right, we don't have 100 holes. We have 79 <laughs> holes filled. 
Oh my god, I can't believe No, I don't want to go down here. Tyron Hill is <laughs> is missing getting a hundred. I'm not mad about killed. it, it's just true. <laughs> not mad. I'm not mad. You're mad. These top down elevator views. You, just that load scene. You feeling it? You feeling that load scene? I feel loaded. Uh, I'm excited for PokeStream. We did not play Arceus uh, because I don't have that game. I I skipped that one because it was too it was too scary for me because it was too different than the the oh, normal Pokemon. I games. made a mistake. I don't actually want to be here. Um, I will maybe play that game eventually, but I'm excited for like a new full fledged adventure in the Pokemon world. Uh, I don't want this. Too scary. Not like this. I would, but I'm too shy. I'm just too shy. How do I activate? This seems like a flaw. What are you trying to activate? I need to get back uh, to where I was. Backtivate. Is that thing coming back? Maybe? Oh, I've made a mistake. It's got it. You can't be just stuck. Surely not. There was a platform right there. Yeah, you're right. Shoo! Too scary. Yeah, I was too scared. <coughs> I wish I could do something, but I'm too shy. Look at all those boxes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's long fall. So you need to fill those hundred holes. I I want to say nah, but whatever. We got we got time. <laughs> we got a little time, yeah. Yeah, I I am definitely gonna play Pokemon on stream. Pokemon, Pokemon. Um, I'm also gonna start my training sessions. You mean Chin Pokemon? Oh man, talk about an old episode. Do you remember the show South oh, Park? I go back to Spider Cave. Um, yeah, I am. Uh, there's a tournament in February that I am going to. Boggy Swamp. So I got to start training for that tournament. Oh, there's a bunch there. So I'm going to stream some of those uh, if you all are interested Look in any this. fighting games. I got to go back to Misty I'm Island where I got to go. Street Fighter V and Guilty Gear Strive. Sorry, I wasn't listening. No, it's cool. I was just hoping that the audience was listening. <laughs> I didn't realize that we don't have Misty Island, and that's a fun one. I'm going to go back to Misty go Island. Go to Misty Island. Speaking of Pokemon, Misty. Nice. Right, so I'm going to do a fun one. Let's just do a fun one. Okay, we'll do a serious picture, and then we'll do a fun one. Do a fun, a silly one. Oh, my God. Guilty Gear. Hell, yeah. I play Eno. Oh man, Brian Rick, Eno. But uh, no, but I love Brian Eno too. Um, Bridget's great. Um, when I played Guilty Gear XX, Did you see how lucky I that played was? Bridget, and Bridget is officially and uh, canonically now, like from the creator of the game, trans. Look at out of here. Uh, there was all this like. Uh, idiots who are like, oh no, uh, they just mistranslated from Japanese. They didn't really mean that. Mistranslated, which is a great name. Mistranslated. Mistranslated. Misunderstood. Um, Misnomer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bridget's great character. Uh, fun to play too. I I bought the DLC for Bridget. I that's like my pocket character um, in Guilty Gear. I play Bridget. Um, but my main Zeno. I don't know what Guilty Gear is. It's a fighting game. Oh, okay. And it's got like a bunch of butt rock in it. Ah, uh, butt rock. Yeah, it's like. Way to go, butt wipe. <laughs> can we translate? Can we uh, not translate? Can I've <laughs> got translate on the brain? Can we uh, travel to fast travel to Misty Island? No, but it's it's from here. Transport was the word I was looking for. Dr. Tran. <laughs> You're telling me his port's trans? But, but rock. rock. Uh, yeah, kind of like, um, I, I, I guess it's probably not butt rock, but butt rock is like 
Uh, <laughs> it's probably not official. The official name. There, there's not like a. I looked this up. There's not like a hard definition for like butt rock. But Ass core. <laughs> it's like rock that takes itself too seriously, like in the vein of like Creed. Um, Creed and like Nickelback and that sort of thing. Play some Creed. All right, where's this freaking mayor? Oh, he's the this one. This is the mayor. Hello, mayor. And I don't really love butt rock, but I'll tell you what, Guilty Gear's songs are actually really good. So maybe I won't put I won't put butt rock. It's just got a lot a lot of like uh, rock and roll um, themes. Oh, I, oh, I just just could you uh, take this uh, power cell out of my hands? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, there is a new Sonic game that came out. It's open world. Oh god. Um, new Sonic. <laughs> I I don't know. Like Sonic's games, are, like are in that that 3D Sonic games. I'll put it that way. 3D Sonic games are in the vein of like, boy, these games are bad, but they're they're fun. Um, Just tree in my way. Maybe when it goes on sale, because you know it's going to go on sale, I'll pick up uh, the new Sonic game. I think it's called Sonic Frontiers. I heard, it's, go. I heard it's not very good. <laughs> but it could be good for a laugh. Uh, some of my favorite episodes we've ever done on this show have been the Sonic games. Mama, 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 mama. Those were just so fun to play. I always just played through Sonic 1. We did. Did we Sonic 1? We did Sonic 1 and Sonic 2 and Sonic 3 and Sonic Mania. <laughs> And Sonic all Spinball. the way through. Yeah, pretty sure. I know we did Sonic Spinball all the way through. Uh, we could play Sonic. Um, we could play Sonic Four. It's not very good, but we could play it. It's a two D Sonic. Sonic One is just a, it's just a fun run through, and it doesn't take very long. We could play. You know what we can play? We could play um, uh, Sonic Generations, which is actually a good uh, Sonic game that came out probably about 10 years ago. I haven't played it. Well, and it, it's 2D and 3D. They mix them. Like 2D. There, there's a 2D Sonic and a 3D <laughs> Sonic. They're like, we're in different dimensions. Oh, and they, the like designs are like the same. Or different, I mean. It's cool. Like there's a little cute, cuddly Sonic from the 2D Did games. we play 3D Blast? 3D Blast. Yeah, we played it. We played, the, we played all the way through it. Did we go all the way through? There was um, the original creator of the game released like a modified version to make it more playable, and we played that one. Are you sure? I do not remember. Positive, that. positive. We beat the whole game. I do not remember that. Look through the archives. I'm gonna have to. That was in the my old house. That's where we played it. Yeah, I would have assumed. Well, we had three filming locations. Yes, the the old apartment, the old house. Yep, and, and now this, this old place. basement. This old dusty basement. And also, hello, Nervous Hair. Welcome to the stream. Nervous Hair! I had to get those two power cells first before I go to Misty Island. I think we played through Sonic Mania twice. I think we played through it with regular Sonic, and we played through it with the new character, Ray the Squirrel. I do not remember this. <laughs> I remember playing Sonic Mania I'm, like once. Go to the YouTube archives. Check the archives. That was before we were on camera. 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 On camera. Do I say camera weird? Camera. <laughs> Nervous arrows up your way yesterday. I, I would have I would have like said something, but I, I literally had no time. I was doing work the whole time. But I was up near a uh, place where you live. <laughs> Good restraint. Uh, uh, yeah, I've been I've been flubbing all day, giving away personal identifying information. I'm trying to not. Oops. What's that for? There's a power cell. Yeah, there's a. How does one get to there? Is this Misty Island? Yeah. It's pretty, pretty historic. Oh, there it is. You have to have eco, though. Yeah, I got it from over there, I think. It sure is. I was driving right there on road, major, major roadway.
Anna, I, nice. Decode that, then you'll know where I was. We need blue. We oh! I know what I need. Tell me what I need. Stupid little man. All right. Oh. How come so you can swim sometimes and not other times? The water's too deep. I can't swim it's in it. It's too deep. All right. You gotta kill that skeleton monster. Kick him while he's down, eh? Maybe we'll do a poll for. Uh, I mean, I think the next time things we're gonna play. We should, one, we gotta play spooky game. And we two, should, we gotta play interactive. Game. We should play a little Jack and Boxster. Yeah. Um, and then maybe we play a spooky game, but maybe we'll put a poll uh, on Twitter and in the Discord oh for gosh, uh, what we play after that. Oh no! my! What the heck? No! God! <laughs> there you go. <laughs> this freaking game! You just gave it away. It's all nighttime now. Can you even go on that thing at night? Can't see. Freaking camera ass. Camera ass. Like, what is that? <laughs> now you know how I feel playing this game all the time. <laughs> That's my all the time play. Oh my god. Ouch. I'm so annoyed. Ouch. Like, Jack grabs ledges, unless he doesn't. You have camera ass. It is terminal. All right. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully, um, I was able to provide Later. some useful information. I don't understand. What the heck? It just launches me past it. I turned it on, though. What an obnoxious thing to have happened. This is risky. Ooh, Ooh pays off. Oh, I see what you mean. It turned it on. You don't have to have it after that. Yeah. Skill issue. Shut up, Mr. Hare. Ah, the gamers. The only true Americans. Which one is that? There's real America. Or no, there's America and then there's real America. And real America is the is for the gamers. It's gamers only. Gamers only. Yes. All the gamers. Why did that? Oh, why fuck. did that? Look at him, stupid frog with his what arms up. The gamers finally rose up. <coughs> they They control everything now. You best believe. Take a nice mud bath. Ohio is a place in which sometimes people live there. I hear that. Yeah. People live there sometimes. I know it's pretty rich coming from any town USA where we are, but... Where even am I? the hugest Ohio. What is this place? I think you got stuck in a liminal space. Idiot. What an idiot. It is. Real America is for lovers. It's too slippery. I mean, we can be we can be done when you want to be done. We finished the game. This is all just... I need 100 this, power cells. This is just icing on the cake. I just need... I need 18 more. <laughs> You are, you are very near to uh, Ohio. You're in the blast zone of Ohio. <laughs> the, my favorite liminal space is um, an imagined place of Discovery Zone when I was a kid that had all of these, probably every germ, probably every germ. Oh yeah. Um, but it was like it had this ball pit and this weird like. Rolly slide with a bunch of rollers that definitely pinched you. I don't know. It was just fun. 
This is what Felt I wanted. Felt infinite. This is what I wanted. The bike! Yes! Yeah, they sure did. They really did. JD fucking Vance. That nurgly little motherfucker. <laughs> nurgly. <laughs> Every germ. That's correct. Yes! You know what I'm talking about. Nervous Hair, you might have gone to the same discovery zone that I did. Almost surely you would have. Um, the one in... I'm giving away location because nobody lives there. Maryville, Indiana. <laughs> Try to find us. We're not there. Try it. You won't. <laughs> I fucking love RM Brown. I actually ended up uh, signing up for his Patreon for two bones uh, so I could get the Tuesday and Thursday episodes because it's, it's like my highlight of my day. It's so fucking funny. It is. Yeah, Nervous Hair knows what I'm talking about. They really want you to be on a bike to do weird things in this game. Like you have to be on like ter like tiny narrow passages and stuff like that. Good job being the power cell. Power cell. Yeah, I haven't listened to the Book of Blega, but I, I want to as well. <laughs> Beware the tubes of March. So you have to get that guy without hitting the mines? There's, yeah, there's one more of them, I think. It just sounds like the propeller boat is in the worst shape of its life. It's oh. holding on for dear life. This thing I'm riding? Yep. Makes a lot of little farty noises. So many little farty noises. You got this, you got this. Wait. Nice! Power cell. What's up? Yeah. Yeah, I think that was the last thing for the bike. You stopped all the mine dropping lurkers. They've been threatening uh, the waters around our village for those weeks. mine dropping lurkers. Bring your back to the trans pad and I'll teleport it back. The trans pad? Good for them. Good for them. You can't have a platform game without a log roller. I think that's true. There's a couple of like needed items in a platforming game. Some kind of a barrel or a log roll. A lot of bridges that are just around, rope bridges. Yeah. A lot of chests, more than you'd think there should be. Like a weird amount of chests just around. Just around. My favorite liminal space is a closed marsh parking lot at 3.27 a.m. with an ice I, and donuts. I love grocery stores like Walmarts at, at 11 p.m. midnight. Yeah. It is so interesting. I always would do my shopping at night because there was nobody there. Yeah. Like, go at, like, midnight. Oh, there are people there. Yeah, but they're weirdos like me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> it rules. I definitely hit that double jump. It's probably because of the TV. Like what is this? I don't what know. What is this machine? <laughs> I do like you know if you're into animation, they do a lot of good squash stretch stuff. In oh this yeah, game. yes. They Even do. whatever the fuck those things are are squashing and squashing and stretching. I watched an interview actually when this. Oh my god! I hit the double jump. I watched an interview when this game came out uh, with Naughty Dog, and they were talking about how they like 
really try to emphasize things like when he does this. His yeah, fist it's gets like fist big. gets big. Yeah. I hear it. Where is it? <laughs> They're workers. They're workers. <laughs> Yeah, see you next week. You two um, you wanna, you wanna call it? Now that the lurkers can't open that oh, but silo, they can't oh, the world you, you just have one more to do. And cause untold destruction. You got like a, a bomb thrower. The two of you have plenty to do. Get on with it. Do you have to destroy all those? Get some. Get some. Yeah. It's just for those orbs, though. Corbs. Horbs dorbs. Horse divorce. I don't know where the last power cell is, but you know, I guess we can call it. I hear it. I hear it. That's where all the murders happen, nervous hair. I'm not crazy, right? No, like, I hear it. It's right there! Oh man. That was a mistake. Oh no, a shark is gonna come get your ass, your little ass. All right, I gotta get that thing now. <laughs> get his ass. What? Get up! Ugh. All right, where was I even? That's some stuff that's, oh, I was that's entered there. into my vernacular from R.M. Brown is saying little ass and pukes. I was way up there. I it might be like a really roundabout way of getting there. That's okay. We're just it's about the journey. The power cells are friends we made along the way. It really Well, in this game it's not. You need the power cells lest you not be able to open You got to fill doors. those holes. Yeah, you got to fill 100 of them. Which is that's a big assignment. It's a lot of holes. That's a for lot of holes to jack fill. To fill. <laughs> Oh, you're just sliding on there. Yeah, that's fine, I guess. Just normal things. Man, you got so much red science going through you right now. I'm powerful! Now you got the blue science. Amazing. We remember what happened the last time we were here. Oh. Last time we were here, you had to fight a boss. Dax returned to Daxter. That's what he was talking about. Well, he's gonna remain it's Daxter. Ambush, you got it's amp an amp bush. It's an ambush. Oh, I got it. And there's just waves coming at you. Yeah, 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 yeah. You ain't nothing. There's so much red sign. You're good. This is like, this should have happened very, very early on in the game. But you just missed the island. Yeah. We came here, got one power cell, and left. <laughs> We're like, bye. This place gives me the willies. Let's keep you out of the My heaves are fully jeebed right now. My heaves are so jeebed. <laughs> Got it. Oh, the only one I don't have is the freaking scout fly one. But who's to say where that is? Yeah, nobody knows. We got the important ones. And more importantly, we beat the effing game. Just need 13 more for that big, big hole fill. Yeah, but not tonight. Nope, not tonight. Um, thanks for everybody for joining us this week. Yes, thank you so much. Appreciate it. If you come by next week, uh, we're going to play games that you can play too. Probably. Probably. Back over those bones. Probably. Thanksgiving's not Thursday, is it? No, it's two from now. Okay, then. 
No yeah. problem. We're gooch. Um, so we'll see everybody next time. On the next time. Bye. Goodbye.